Home heating costs are expected to jump this winter, and there's one fuel that's creating more pain at the pump than any other. We have introduced you to customers who are left high and dry because of the kerosene shortage, but they're not the only ones. 13 Investigates' Tessa Bentulin is here to explain more. Tessa. Sabrina Mark, the war in Ukraine, a cut in foreign oil production, inflation and supply chain issues. It's a perfect storm that's pushed the price of home eating heating fuels through the roof. But when it comes to kerosene, retailers are not asking how much. They're asking, how can we find it? And if you're a new customer, you'll get $50 off your first delivery. Family Dan's has long prided itself on quality fuel for every customer. But this year, there is one petroleum product that won't be pumped out of their trucks and into your home tank. At this point, we are not going to be carrying kerosene. Nobody can afford that. Carrie Honig is not alone. Retailers across the capital region tell us their wells have run dry and there is no kerosene to be found at any price. The Port of Albany hasn't seen a shipment in months and no one seems to know when it might come ashore. Even before supplies dried up, kerosene compared to other fuels was pricey. Take a look at this graph that shows what's happened to kerosene prices in the last year. You could see there was a huge spike to nearly $7 in June. Depending on their region of the state, the price now hovers around $6, and that's if you can find it. So why is this crude oil derivative more expensive than others? Experts say it's the distillation process that helps kerosene handle the cold. Unlike propane and oil, kerosene won't freeze in the outdoor tanks. But Kerry Honig says there is an alternative. We put in, you know, an additive that's called, you know, a sub-zero that is for, you know, a 275 tank and it's worked great for my customers. Now there are a few other solutions if you can't get any kerosene. We'll have those tips for you at five o'clock. Sabrina. Tessa, thank you. I called my hometown um, oil company to ask them to come up and top off my fuel tanks and uh, they said well, I would love to do that for you, but we have no kerosene. And I said, well, what do you mean you have no kerosene? He said, there is none available at the Port of Albany. Yesterday, we introduced you to Hilda, who told us that she's concerned that she might not be able to heat her home during the coldest months of the year. Why? A kerosene shortage affecting the Northeast. Tonight, 13 Investigates decided to take a closer look at the problem and what solutions there are for you. Tessa Bentulin is here to take us through what she found out. Tessa. Rachel, kerosene is not coming through the Port of Albany like Hilda said, and kerosene distributors do not have any available for their customers who use that type of oil to heat their homes. It's been going on for months now, but the problem has not surfaced until now that it's getting colder. So what's to blame for the shortage? The war in Ukraine, a cut in foreign oil production, inflation and supply chain issues. If you need kerosene, don't worry, you're not out of luck. Paul Wells at Newcomb Fuel Oil says you have a few options for alternatives. Number one, use a tank blanket slash installation blanket to keep the fuel from gelling up. Number two, use a plug-in heater around the fuel line. And number three, you can buy additives to control waxing and gelling, and it cleans the system as well. I have everybody pretty much holding off. People aren't really desperate yet, but when the time does come, we're going to have to move to this alternative. But one of the biggest problems for distributors is when they can get kerosene for their customers. Global, the company at the Port of Albany who supplies these retailers like Paul Wells with kerosene, tells us the petroleum will be coming in very soon. In a statement they sent to us, they said there is no demand for kerosene over the summer months and no reason to store it over that period. We plan to have kerosene available within the next week to start the season for our customers.